Well, we know one championship contender is through. Will Leighton Fine get through as well? Eugene Aronson says, you're not there yet, Leighton. Standing in his way. I think Eugene is going to make life extremely difficult. One of the guys you probably wouldn't want to come up against if you were running for a championship along the way. Eugene has the power of just really pulling out an excellent run from nowhere and causing a lot of trouble. See, they're aggressive going in, aren't they? They really peel across to the left and then throw it in. The Drift Performance Products onboard camera shows fine working the tail of Aronson. Good proximity, good angle. How sideways in the transition there. That's really good on the line too. You notice there very clearly that Aronson did uh, straighten the car a little bit there, a bit Eugene. of a correction. Eugene did a great job, but Fine has just stuck with him the whole way. Man, and not only that, forced a little bit of a mistake coming downhill into the last corner. The pressure is on, Leighton Fine, huge now. Aronson has really thrown up exactly what Leighton didn't want, a massive opening drift battle. Look at this now. Have a really good look. Eugene Aronson there is really trying to stay with Leighton Fine, but look at Leighton's line there. Much better line. Picking up the racing line the whole way around, making it difficult for Eugene, and Eugene once again straight on the entry to turn nine. She didn't Aronson come back big time. This is a minor correction just there from Aronson. That's all it takes. And Fine, the mark of a champion. He comes back 12 8. Late and fine through to the top four. Crabman, mate, you must have a load come off the shoulders every time you get a win. Yeah, mate, that was, <laughs> that's hard work. He is fast. He is really fast and really good. And uh, there's a bit of nerves because they know six. It was huge to knock me out to lose a championship. So <laughs> every time there's something, isn't there? <laughs> the Toyo top four is moments away. El Huli Yates. Fink is up against Fine. If Fink loses here, Fine wins the championship. Well, that was the wildest top eight I have ever seen, but things are about to get even crazier. Leighton Fine and Luke Fink are about to go head to head in the top four. This will decide the 2008 championship. Stick around, because after the break, you're going to see what is considered the battle of the year.